there, we are getting ready to do an IPL treatment. So IPL stands for intense pulse light. This is a broad spectrum light. I'm gonna wear protective eyewear and so is my client. She's prepped, she's ready to go. Um, and I want you to see her skin before and then I'll get a close up after, but this is the before. So um, she has good skin. It's just um, over time, a couple of sunspots and that's really what we're working on today. So what I'd like to do is work through two filters, but her skin is going to tell me if that's possible. This video is gonna be sped up, but if you have any questions, just comment below. If you, this video is helpful, subscribe to my channel. All right, here we go. Now this gel we use, it's Sonogram gel. It works as a conductor for the light. It works as a barrier for her skin, and we keep it room temp, although it does feel kind of cold when we do the treatment. So I'm gonna put it on the area that I'm about to work, and then move on. done the cheek and the chin now we're moving up to the forehead for the forehead I like to use a little more gel it's just skin against bone so that's what I'm going to do to create a little bit more of a barrier for her comfort really well so I'm gonna go into another layer of the skin hoping to pull more pigment up and out giving her a better result um, and also promoting collagen production so the deeper layers um, do a great job of heating up the collagen and just assisting its growth so that's what I'm going to do next um, as you can see hopefully the areas of concern where she just had some sun damage they definitely are a little darker, a little more upset, and that is exactly what you want. In fact, it'll take seven to 10 days for those to recover, but she could walk out of here and put makeup on and nobody would probably know. Um, I always tell people to do this two weeks shy of any important event, three weeks is even better because technically your skin needs three weeks to fully heal. All right, so I'm gonna go back through, do one more pass, um, and then I'll get her all cleaned up and show you after. Here we go. Doesn't 
doesn't even have to be as thorough. I'm more concerned with going over any pigment. Oh, okay. Um, and just for collagen production, but. We did it. So I'm going to clean up the gel a little bit so you can see the after. Her skin is going to feel like it has a sunburn. And as I said before, it's completely okay to put makeup on immediately after a treatment. Um, in fact, the only thing you really need to avoid are any strong anti-aging products. You want to avoid exercise for 24 to 48 hours um, so that you don't have as much swelling. If, especially if you're treating redness or broken blood vessels, you can get more swelling when you're trying to collapse blood vessels. Um, steam rooms, hot tubs, and saunas are a no-no, and you have to be extra careful in the sun two weeks before and after a treatment because um, your skin is going to be more sensitive to sunlight. So SPF of a, at least a 30 is crucial and absolutely mandatory. But beyond that, honestly, by tomorrow, she won't even feel like she did this. And in the next two weeks, she'll see all the benefits of this treatment. So I have just cleaned off the gel. I'm gonna finish getting her all cleaned up, but I want you to see how your skin might look after a treatment. And this is more of um, a typical IPL treatment. So this is not a crazy wild setting. This is just a really effective, good solid treatment. So that's what we did today. If this was helpful to you, if this made you less terrified of stepping in um, an IPL room, which I hope it did because I love it, it's my favorite treatment, then click like, subscribe, and comment below.